Before using the product, please check whether the accessories and consumables are complete. Make sure you have the following items. 1. Plastic sample collection spoon. 2. Sample collection tube with preservation fluid inside. 3. Two sample collection papers. 4. Biohazard bag. 5. Sample return envelope. If any of these items are missing from the kit, do not use the kit. Refer to the instructions for return and contact information before using the kit. Collect the sample on a day when you will be able to return the sample within 24 hours after collection. Keep out of reach of children. Following the instructions, wash hands thoroughly to start sampling. Step 1. Raise the toilet lid and seat. Open the package and take out the sample collection paper. Peel off the protective films on the sample collection paper to expose the adhesive strips. And place and stick the adhesive strip of the sample collection paper over the toilet rim. Make sure that the sample collection paper is curled downward, leaving enough space for the collection and keeping stool away from your body. And make sure that the sample collection paper does not touch toilet water. Step 2. Place the collection tube on the tube stand. Close the sample collection kit on the top of the lid and find the circle marked as tube stand. Take collection tube and puncture a hole in the middle of the circle and place the collection tube on the tube stand with the red cap facing up. Open the tube by turning the red colored cap counterclockwise. Hold the tube with your other hand if needed. Step 3. Collect the stool sample with the collection spoon and deposit the sample in the collection tube. Use the collection spoon and collect one full spoon stool sample from two or three different areas on the surface of the stool. Insert the spoon with the stool sample back to the collection tube which was placed on the tube stand. Push the spoon towards the bottom of the collection tube to ensure that the sample is fully submerged in the preservation fluid. Press on the top of the spoon handle to detach the spoon from the spoon handle. Gently pull the spoon handle out of the collection tube. The spoon handle can be discarded. Step 4. Close the collection tube. Screw the cap shut by turning it clockwise. If the cap is not closed and tightened properly, the liquid could leak out of the tube. Gently pull the closed collection tube out of the tube stand. Flush the toilet along with the flushable sample collection paper. Step 5. Return the collection tube with the stool sample. Place the collection tube into the biohazard bag. Seal the biohazard bag and put it into the sample return envelope. Follow the return instructions and refer to contact information to return the package. Make sure your stool sample is returned within 24 hours after collection.